umeboshi is a little apricot, salty, and is aged in salt, sea salt, and is very strong and energized, and is like a, a big effect and a strong. You, you cannot ignore it when you taste it. When we start reading and learning about macrobiotic and this alimentation, we start discovering a new world and a new way of uh, approaching everything we do, relation with people, art, life, and spirituality. So it's like the beginning of the change. And we wanted to put this in our artistic um, activities. So we all are dancers and some actress and that modern dancer and tango dancer. So we try to put this uh, new approach, a new way of feeling life into uh, what we do. Omeboshi Effect is a group of performers that, and also a group of friends that started like uh, a year and a half ago in Buenos Aires. We all come from different backgrounds so I think that uh, really can be seen in what we do in our performances in our workshops we are trying to, to use all of the elements that we have to, to put it together in a, in, a, in a new tango experience Why are we here? Mm, <laughs> this is a tricky question. <laughs> Tango celebration, what we are doing. We want to bring people together and give them something that's coming from a group of people that got some things in common. And those things in common are, well, of course, our love of Tango. group work that is something quite seldom in, in tango, tango festivals and that, where everything is centered on, on the couples. And this is, uh, although we are have couples, we are couples for logical reasons, we, we also work a lot in group and there's a lot of group things going on in between the dances and it's what we try to do with the people also, not to stick to the partners but to, to make a group deal out of this. It's a, a new type of event because it's organized, directed, created by a group of dancers.
Tango, as we say, is a game, it's a way of enjoying life. And we wanted to share that with everybody side by side. I think individualism has been the theme of the last century. Maybe this is a turning point. We live dancing, we live expressing, we live playing around with this dance. In a world which is so structured, where people is like all the time living in a very rational and logic way, to being, having the possibility of being in a place for a few days with a community of people and just create this magic environment where everybody can feel free to play and to dance and to have fun, <laughs> is what we want to bring to the world, actually. worried that people will get disturbed or how do you say offended by this new way of discover tango all the people that are interested are welcome and all the people that are not interested are also welcome <laughs> We don't expect to be pure. I mean, we are pure in the way that we love dancing. We love dancing with other people, and, and we love this music, and this is what we do. But we, we want to go as far as we can expressing with tango. Tango in the last six years is changing a lot. It's in a very big process. So we are many, many people getting things into it. Maybe sticking to the conventional tango, maybe uh, putting new things. Some would put drama, some would some put other things. We have chosen to look for this, this path where, where we use um, stage arts to put into tango and to see what happens to, to push hard on the, on the artistic tango. We dance what we are, we dance the way we live today and that's what we transmit and we express. I don't think we could possibly express how people lived in the 19th century. And, uh, well, that's as simple as that.